Miranda. It's Miranda from Diamond Painting with the Besties. How are you? Welcome back to the channel. And if you're new, welcome. It's great to have you. Merry Christmas Eve, everyone. Can you believe that it is the 24th of December already? It is insane. Yeah, I can't believe it. Oh my God. So I we have untubing and if you have been around a while you probably recognize that this is from craftably and i was kind of toying around with what i should do next because i've been doing a lot of craftablys because this was like part of my big huge pre-order but then i was like well the time of year and let's finish off this you know group of pre-orders that i got so without me going on and on let's get into it so I'm excited, one, because now I have this pink or a coral colored tube, and I don't have that one, be that one, and it's really sturdy plastic, and I absolutely love it. There, it's branded as well. You can see it right here. It says Craftably Diamond Painting. You know, it's got its traveling strap right here, and you can adjust it. And sometimes I forget how, but there we go. You can adjust it so you can carry it over your arm if you choose. And you can change it to multiple different sizes right here. So it doesn't just fit one particular diamond painting. You can probably fit a couple in here um, or whatever you want. A couple snack sizes or a bigger one. But today we have Santa's Pack. And Santa's pack is a 20 by 28 inch painting. Um, I can't remember if it's a round or a square or not. And I know Suzette did untube this one. I haven't seen anyone else. Uh, maybe Miss Crochet and Coffee. But it's Christmas, so let's finish it off with something from the season. So let's get all of our contents out of the tube right here. And that is it. I hope everyone is got all their preparations done and can finally relax. So what do you get in a Craftably kit? Well, you get your canvas in a dust bag with your drills inside. And then you get this amazing burlap, soft purple burlap bag. I love reusing these. And they come with all sorts of goodies. Um, if you want to see the toolkit, the entire toolkit broken down. Um, I'll link one of my other Craftably videos up in the eye so you can check that out. And we're just going to go over the little extras. So on top of your toolkit, you know, that comes with your bow and your tweezers and your multiplacers and your squishy it comes in this branded bag right here. You also get um, a pot of wax branded pot of wax, and then you also get a minder. So I'm excited because I have like three different heart ones right now. And this one's pretty cool. You guys can see it. And then you also get two random rolls of washi tape. And this one is ice cream and popsicles. And we have some red and white striped. So that is really cool. I love um, that you get washi tape with your toolkit. So your canvas does come in a plastic dust bag to protect it, which I really do like. There is also a piece of scotch tape wrapped around your canvas. Do not worry. It will not harm your kit at all. You know, it'll just might have some fuzzies on it, but it's not going to damage your kit at all. It is just to help it stay closed. Um, yeah, I kind of craftably did, did, did the most with these pre-orders and I just couldn't help it. So I'm glad they're being spaced out. And to top it off, this last drop of pre-orders they had, oh my God, amazing. All right, so let us unroll our canvas and it is that soft, it's not quite a limp bag, but it says softer material, it is poured glue. Here are our drills and here is our image again, Santa's pack, and it is a round. Oh, thank you, Jesus. It is a round. And there looks like there's some special things in here, and we'll get into that a little bit later. 
So it's a larger size canvas. Um, it is scalp, uh, scalloped right here. There is a little tear right here at the top, but I don't care because it's gonna get covered up and no one's gonna see it. It doesn't affect the drill area. So I'm just gonna let this um, rest for a little bit and we're gonna go over what else comes with it. So you do get a nice um, sheet of instru detailed instructions on how to diamond paint with pictures. You also um, get to find out, you know, some of the new goodies that they put in here, the new washi tape and the new cover minder. And then on the back, it lists everything that your new 4.0 kit features on here as well. And a big welcome to the Craftably family. Next, we have our, le our legend and it tells, um, the size and then you get a sticker for your logbook with a start and stop time there's some little extra stickers right here and then here are some um, already pre-cut labels right here and there are 56 colors in here and there's actually extra pre-cut labels right on the side for you in case you need like extra like containers or whatever so this also comes with one two three four ab's and two two special whether it's a crystal we'll have to find out so that is really exciting i was so excited about this because well one it's super inclusive um i am so happy that they have um a poc you know as santa because santa can be or look however your imagination wants him to be. So I am like was like, bravo, craftably, I absolutely love it. And I love how more and more diamond painting companies are um, being more inclusive and offering a different variety of diamond paintings, whether the individuals are Asian or African American. It's not your standard, you know, how you would see whether it's in a village or a tribe. It's everyday people, just like our entire world is filled with everyday people. And I'm glad it's being celebrated. So I'm really excited about that craftably. So let us get into this. Let's look at this picture and let me get off my little soapbox. Are you guys ready? Here we go. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. Now, I did say that Suzette did unbox this, and it looked absolutely amazing, but it looks even more amazing in person. The canvas is super glittery. At the top, you'll see that it is branded, and it says Craftably Diamond Painting right here. We have one legend in our upper left. We have another one in our lower right with a thumbnail. And then at the bottom, it says San Santa's Pack by Marcelo Corti. So it is legally licensed and that is the artist down there. So that is an added bonus as well. I am excited to see what these ABs are. What do you guys think? First, I am gonna check the stickiness. I'm gonna peel back the plastic. I really like Craftably's plastic the best. It's a nice in-between. It's not too thick, it's not too thin. It is so sticky. Wow. It's so beautiful. The symbols are super, super clear. I don't have any issues. Even if I didn't use a light pad, I would not have any issues with these. Um, yeah, it is pretty cool. Sorry, guys. My nail is bothering me. Sorry. So I noticed... In Suzette's video, she was making a comment about the face looking kind of reddish, but I saw as she worked on it, the colors are great. So I'm excited for that. Let's see what symbols. So we have, looks like a light pink AB, a red, a white, more of a, another kind of red, and then two other colors. So the white is a circle and I can already tell it's all over Santa's beard, the cuffs on his jacket, the trim on his jacket, the trim on his pom-pom, his hat, 
his hair, his eyebrows, his mustache. Like Santa is going to be blinged out. Let's see. I'll bring you guys up so you can see the symbol clarity. I hope you can see all right. Like I'm loving the color of this right here, his sack right here filled with presents. We've got a candy cane, a teddy bear. I love the twinkling of snowflakes. So it looks like it's snowing just a little bit. I love like the kind look on his face. I like the blue sky, like kind of like when the moon is out or just the brightness from street lights and the snow reflecting. It gives the sky a bluish look to it. So let us um, check these out. So I'm gonna flip this over and we're gonna check out these ABs real quick. If I can ever remember how to get into this. I, here we go. They are in order. So I know to look at the end. So let's, hopefully I didn't grab. So we have 56, 55, 54, 53, 52, 51, and 50 is not an AD. All right, put that over here. So we do have All right, so we do have two different shades of red AB. They are slightly different, 54 uh, or 52 looks to be a little darker. It's kind of hard to tell. This one is, seems a little more pink to me than this one, seems more red. We got this big old bag of white, super pretty. And then we have this light purple right here then we have a orange crystal, and then we have a pink crystal, and we're gonna see where those go. All right, give me a second, you guys. Okay, I'm back. I bet you didn't even know that I was gone. All right, I just had to stir my dinner. All right, you guys, so where were we? We were going to see where the ABs are at. So I'm going to just, since the crystals are right in my hand, we will start with 56. It is a triangle. There isn't very much of it. So I'm going to head up here because I think it would be, if I was a pink crystal AB, I would be in the presence. And right here we have a little bit in this ribbon on this present, a little bit over here as well. So not very much at all. Then 55 is orange. And that is uh, like a, kind of looks like an antenna, one of them old school antennas. And I still think that's gonna be up in the presence. And where are we? Here we go. So there's a little bit over here and a little bit over on here on that toy right there. So not very much. 51 is like a hat, like a circle hat and the bottom half is dark. So that's gonna be up in here and all up in this present right here. We already said where the white's gonna go. And then we have 52 and 54. 54 is an M and 52 is like a white box in a red square. Oh, there's a little bit of crystal right here and some of the pink. Oh no, it's a half triangle. But there is some orange crystal up in the crease right here. We've got some red of the red AB up in here with the M and more of the M right here. And the only thing now I'm looking for is that half filled circle. So I'm seeing a half moon. If you guys know where it is, please. Oh, here it is. It's up in Santa's hat. It's highlighting his hat. It's 
if you guys hear that sound, it is raining here. I know a shock, but yeah, so it's sprinkled in his hat and over kind of in the creases of his jacket right here. There's a little bit right. No, that's the three dots. Anyway, it's somewhere here. It's basically up in the upper part in his hat and then the white goes in his beard and then all the trim. And then the rest of the ABs and the crystals are gonna go all up in those presents. So that is it, you guys. This is Santa's Pack by Marcelo Corti. Um, it is a 20, when I say 20 by 28 inch and it's got 56 colors and it is around. So let me know what you think. Did anybody else snag this one? I absolutely love it. Unfortunately, um, it's probably going to have to wait until next Christmas for me to do it. I might actually take a couple months to do some Christmas ones, but who knows? Next year is a long way off. I say that. But watch, we're going to blink and it's going to be Christmas again. All right, you guys. So I will link this kit down below. If it's available, go and get it. Go snag it. There's a whole bunch of affiliates out there where you can use their codes. Um, and if it's not, get signed up for the email. So that way you'll get notified when this comes back in stock. All right. So I hope you guys have a safe and happy and healthy Christmas Eve to my friends and creators who do not celebrate Christmas. I am wishing you a safe and healthy evening wherever you are within the country or the world. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Remember, be safe and be kind. Merry Christmas. Bye. <laughs>